Hi everybody and welcome back to Relax My Dog. Now today we're going to be doing a versus for different types of dogs. We're going to be doing a Border Collie, as you can see here, one that I made earlier, uh, or didn't. And we're also going to be comparing a Border Collie to an Australian Shepherd. They are both very, very similar in looks and appearance, but today we're going to be talking about what the similarities are, what the differences are between them, and all that sort of stuff. Before we do get started though, definitely do go down below to the comments and let me know what comparison would you like me to do next? Would you like me to do a pug combined with a French Bulldog, would you like me to do a pug versus a Border Collie, would you like me to do a Shih Tzu compared to a Rottweiler, let me know down below in the comments what you want to see from us in our comparison videos next. But let's just jump straight in. <coughs> So I'm actually going to be doing the similarities and the differences. I will pop them on screen, what the similarities are and the differences as we go through. So let's just jump straight in. So the first similarity and probably the most obvious similarity is they are both high energy dogs. They are both working dogs and so they need a lot of exercise per day. I mean, this thing over here, he requires like four walks a day. He just needs to be doing something all of the time, which is a very, very good thing about a dog, but some people might see it as a very, very bad thing if they don't have a lot of time on their hands. So if you don't have a lot of time, I wouldn't get a Border Collie or an Australian Shepherd because they are going to be too much for you to handle. Not only do they need the physical stimulation, they also need the mental stimulation as well, which I can definitely tell you that from Milo. He constantly needs to be doing something, constantly needs the love and the attention from his owners. Now the next similarity is they are very, very similar in their intelligence. However, a Border Collie definitely beats them at that. A Border Collie is one of the most intelligent dogs in the world, so it's gonna be very, very hard for any other dog to compete with them. Look at him, he's standing proud, he's proud to be an intelligent dog. Now as we all know, Border Collies are workaholics and they absolutely love to be doing something all of the time. And they also have rare characteristics, like Milo is an absolute nutter most of the time. However, that doesn't mean that an Australian Shepherd isn't intelligent. They are still extremely intelligent dogs. They do have a really, really good work ethic as well. Now, the next thing to compare a Border Collie and an Australian Shepherd is their looks. Obviously, they look very, very similar in shape and size. However, Border Collies have many more varieties in their coats. They can be black, red, blue. They can be black and white. They can be red and white. There are many, many different variations of a Border Collie. Australian Shepherd does still have different variations, but just not as many. You can get them in red, blue, and black, and they can sometimes have white in there and also some spots as well. However, for both, grooming is an essential part to their weekly routine, so something to definitely consider. Now, forgetting about their fur, in terms of their actual size of the dogs, for both a Border Collie and also Australian Shepherd, the females are exactly pretty much the same size in their size and also their weight as well. However, an Australian Shepherd tends to be a much bigger dog when it comes to the males. Now, another difference is their characteristics and their traits. Border Collies tend to be alert, lively and diligent and they thrive on the activity and an Australian Shepherd is known to be very, very loyal to their masters and to be dedicated towards them. Now, another similarity between them is they are both both very very easy to train I think it's because they are both an intelligent dog so this will sort of come hand in hand but they are easy dogs to train so if you're looking for a dog to train these would be the perfect one for you to pick. Border Collies tend to be a generally healthy dog. They don't necessarily have a whole bunch of health conditions. However, there are some things you do need to look out for, such as things like epilepsy and hip dysprasia and also they can have deafness as well with Border Collies. Are you okay? I don't think Milo's gone deaf just yet, have you? You can hear anything from miles away. Well, maybe not. But you can hear these from very, very far away, can't you? Whereas Australian Shepherds tend to have many more different health problems, such as a cataract, a thyroid disease, lymphoma, and also epilepsy as well. But that is it for this week's video. I really, really do hope you enjoyed it. To me, an Australian Shepherd and a Border Collie are very, very similar dogs. And um, they both have the same sort of work ethic. They're very, very intelligent dogs. They're very similar in shape and size. And also their variation in color is very, very similar. However, Border Collies do beat them on that way. Like I said, don't forget to let me know down below in the comments what do you want to see next so what comparison would you like us to do for our next future videos let me know down below in the comment before you leave as well don't forget to follow us over on our other social media channels we have instagram facebook and also twitter which you can follow us we are all at relax my dog aren't we also don't forget to give this video a big, big thumbs up if you enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe by clicking the little button over here and you can also check out our previous video which is all the way on the other side of the screen if you would like to learn more 
or more about your dog. Thank you all so, so much for watching. I'm Mia Miley here. We'll see you next week for next week's video. Bye.